Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minimap. And today, we're going to learn about evaluating limits. I'm going to evaluate each limit here. So, if I was given this limit, the limit as x approaches pi of the sine of x. Okay. Well, sine is a trig function here, and trig functions are we can take the limit wherever they exist, because that's where they're also continuous. Okay. So we can plug pi directly in for x, so we have the sine now of pi, and the sine of pi is just zero. So this limit, very quickly, uh, we get our answer of just zero. So let's recap. We're given a limit as x approaches pi of sine of x. Well, sine is a trig function, which means we can plug in directly what we're taking the limit of at that value, provided it exists there. Because it exists, it's also continuous. Okay, there's one of the rules with trig functions, and we take the limit there. Well, we plug pi in for x, so we have the sine of pi here, and we know that the sine of pi is zero. So again, our final answer to this limit is zero. 